Anyway guys, we're just gonna be making uh, the fountain outside the house today with uh, a little help from Damien for today's upload, which is Tuesday. And if you're gonna build this, all you're gonna need is stone brick stairs, stone brick blocks, chiseled stone, and some chiseled stone slabs too. And one brick wall and one end rod, but you don't have to have this. And of course you're gonna need some water for the fountain. Now let's begin. You're going to want to start with uh, an outline like this, which is one, two, three, four, five, five, and then two diagonal, five, two diagonal, five, two diagonal, and five over here. And you want to get the chiseled stone, and you want to put it right here, and right here, and then grab stone brick, and put them right here like this, and like that make it look like that <clears throat> and you're going to find the center before after you finish the entire so we'll go around and finish this so the center is we'll mark it again jesus christ we'll mark it uh there's center and then you're going to want to copy this on all four sides and the corners right here will just be the stone brick and then just to the stone, boop boop, and then the staircases again. And then you're gonna want to find the middle and go up 15 blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, now that you're 15 blocks up, if you don't have to do this part, but it just makes it look a little bit better, you get your uh, wall and your end rod and place it just like that. And then you can just come down or however you want to get down. Uh, it's kind of nighttime. We can just go to bed real quick once it's nighttime. All right, and then right here, you're going to want to Go like this to make it look like it's being supported and then dig out all the dirt so we can place in stone brick down here all right now when you finish that you're just gonna wanna go one, two, three, four, and then above that one, I think, you're gonna wanna do that. And you're gonna wanna go two out on each side, just like that. And then connect it like that. So that there's one hole right in the middle. And you're gonna do that all the way around, just like that. And then this is where the stone staircases are going to come into play more. Where are they? Mm, there's one. And you're going to want to go one, one. And you're going to want to do that just like that on all the sides. Just like that. And then um, with these, you're going to want to, actually, let's just fill them up with blocks. So just fill them up with blocks, just like those ones. <clears throat> and then I need some more stone bricks, so we'll be right back. All right, I got my stone brick. Maybe you can have some. And then you're going to build up back to this floor again. Uh, of course I fell off. I'm gonna get on here and then count up <clears throat> four again. So one, two, three. And on the fourth one, you're gonna just wanna go all the way around just like this. Boop, boop, boop. <clears throat> and then with the 
stairs instead of on the sides we're gonna put them just like this into the middle and if we've done it properly there should be one two three four five six there should be six now just to make sure i'm gonna look at the promotion and maybe we could change it just a little bit if we might want now i'm thinking since there's actually four i think that that one needs to go up one more there's actually four on the first like like there's a four block difference there's only three here and so i think we should go up. actually one more with the level so one two three four and we'll put it right there oh come on well i probably should have got some scaffolding blocks but it's fine and then now we'll put them like that and now there should be one two three four and then there's that and then what you want to gonna <laughs> what you want to gonna get i clearly can't say right now but uh break all the dirt if you have any dirt or any scaffolding and you're gonna want to get a water so we'll go get water real quick As you just saw, I got my water buckets, and if you don't have them filled, obviously find a water source, just like I'm doing right now, and just fill them up. It's easiest if you just have two, and then first you might want to place the water at the bottom if you want all water sources. And then I like to fill in the staircases because it just makes it look a little bit better. But you don't have to if you don't want to. Some people like it look stupid. And then you're going to want to go all the way up. To the very top. And place one water bucket in the stone wall or on top of the block if you didn't do the stone wall. And then if you had scaffolding, obviously break it as you get down, but don't go all the way down. You're going to want to put water all right here so that it actually um, flows right. Because without you putting water up here, it doesn't flow properly. And so... You're going to need a couple water buckets. Clearly. A couple more, and it will actually almost be done. Yo, I just finished putting on the last details, and I want to see what it looks like when I walk out of the house. Ooh, dude, it already looks freaking good. Oh, this looks so good right outside the house. And in comparison to the house, it actually looks pretty um, balanced like this, between the sizes. And uh, for lighting it up, uh, I put the end rod up there to light that part up. And then down here, what you're going to want to do is um, every space where the water goes in you're going to want to put a sea lantern or a light source of your choice and the reason you want to do it underneath the uh, um like pieces of water or like uh underneath the, where the water's coming down is because in the 1.14 update or like the update that they just added recently for ps4 at least um it makes it where if there's like a, a lamp or some light source right here, it makes like this singular block source like super, super light. And so if it's down below, it doesn't do that because the water's like all above it. So, 
so evenly light it up and then what you're going to want to do is um on all the other spots that um like show light like after like a tinted light you're going to want to put um carpet and probably gray carpet to match the rest of the build and so um all the light is even and i'm going to do that and then you'll see what i mean right after yo so um once you get your light source that you want to choose like we chose redstone lamps right here you're just going to want to gonna place the carpet over the redstone lamps and then wait till it's nighttime to see what i mean by the like the tinted water sources and stuff Yo, and if you liked the video, uh, give it a like, and peace out. See ya.